Hello Ratbags, it's Jade. Welcome back to another Windbound Let's Play video. Uh, we've been really struggling. Like, I'm pretty sure I should have completed this maybe without dying so often and so much. But don't worry, it is that type of game. It's the whole point of it. We're going to activate all three of these today. I'm determined to do it. We've got some decent... Oh my god, this island though. This island is awful. Remember, if you drop in the water, you will die. Like, you know, don't don't lose your stam. And you'll respawn on the last islands that you were on. Um, but, yeah, we, we definitely need to do it today. So, let's see what we've got in inventory. We've got a bunch of stuff that we kept from last time. I was a bit, I ain't gonna lie, I was a bit salty. Because I damaged my boat on an island and I couldn't get off and do anything with it. It did kind of pee me off a little bit, but we've got some metal arrows, we've got our sling, we've got our bone tip spear still, we've got a hammer, we've got a shovel, and we've got some more bone and some more leather. That's a pretty good amount of stuff. Um, ideally, I guess we've got to try and make a bag or a boat, one of the two. Um, I wish you could put the blueprints down and just add to it. That would be a lot quicker because I haven't got any space now. Um, so I'm going to have to see if I can make a bag ASA pronto, maybe. Yeah, what do I need for a bag? Grass rope and palm fronds. Please let there be some palm fronds here. Otherwise I'm going to have to drop some stuff straight away. And I don't want to do that. Barely any even grass on this one. Okay, but... No, see, so we're full up. We are full up. Maybe I'll make the boat and we'll put a bag on the boat. Because that seems to be a resource that you can get a lot quicker and a lot easier. Don't worry, your life will be spared today, little ones. Ain't got time. Ain't got time. There we go. Right, I've got our boat again. Once more. Okay. And then let's see if I can actually do a bag or something to go on top of it. Just some more thick grass. Yeah, we got that. We got that one. So we'll be able to take our tools with us and set off on another journey and hopefully complete it this time. I'm pretty sure chapter one, yeah, we're meant to have completed. A little bit quicker than I've, I have done. I kind of knew this game would be a little bit tough. Like it is all roguelikes. Games where you die and you partially basically have to start all over again. They're always pretty tough, um, but I don't know. I just felt like I was still getting used to the mechanics and I've died to a couple of times where I am usually not the most patient dude. Like I always go into something and just like, yeah, Leroy Jenkins. And uh, and then I'll die straight away and everyone's got to pick me up normally in a multiplayer game. Um, doesn't mean I'm bad at games because sometimes, particularly multiplayer games, I'm normally pretty good. I'm pretty tasty on the old uh, FPS shooter. But yeah, sometimes you need to be a little bit, oh no, be a bit more patient. We'll dump some stuff in here. We'll pick up our tools that we made. And we'll be away, away with the fairies. Oh, that's so that's so much better. I'm so much lighter now. All right, let's go and pick up my tools. Where did I drop them? There they are. Oh, good, they're floating around. My stamina is so low. Definitely first chance I get. I want to see if I can pick up. Look at her face. She's like, oh, I'm knackered. I'm absolutely cream crackered. All right, it seems to be in a nice straight line as well this time. There's two of them. So we'll activate these. I'm guessing that might be the third one. Bit of luck. Yeah, I could have probably just about swam to this one. So I don't know if that does damage your ship. Maybe you've got to be a bit more careful. Maybe that was my mistake as well. Right, interacting, done. I'm going to skip it, guys. I'm going to skip it. I've seen this too many times. So, honestly, in the first stages, I was upgrading this raft and I picked up a um, the sail for it. But, kind of, you don't really want the sail because the wind kicks in and then um, you're kind of fighting against the wind sometimes. Maybe it's intentional. Maybe the wind is, like, directing you. And I should have probably been paying a bit more attention to it. That's something I'll have to test out. Oh, this island's teeming with life. But more importantly, it's got the next thing majiggy. But yeah, it's pretty punishing. That stamina bar going down so much and not replenishing. So, you know, I, I can't wait to get an upgrade. That's for sure. Oh, let's get this one's a little bit more difficult, I swear. Maybe it's been quite easy. Jumping is a little bit derpy in this game. I ain't gonna lie. Wait, mantles on stuff. It works sometimes. Sometimes it don't. There we go. I've got me big conch. Conch number two. So that's where we got to go. Once we get the second conch, that's where we got to go. That's like the, the end goal. We'll take a look at the map. 
it's not kind of revealing, but yeah, that's where we're meant to go. So now we've just got to find the, the third island. From here, it doesn't look like there's anything on that one. And the blue ones mean we've been there. But not always, actually. I swear there's I found um, there's another blue one to the left. Yeah, look, there's a little blue light. And I went to it and there was like nothing there. But we'll see what's, what's going on. I'm going to see if we can get some of uh, the... The old... Whatchamacallit? Oh, we've got one of these guys on here. Could do that. No, actually, we don't need any more upgrades. We've got all the tools that we need. That's one good thing. Oh, you, you stay away, fam. I've got no business for you today. Oh, yeah, just running away. Just running away. Don't want to mess with you today, pal. We'll eat these berries. Always eat the berries as much as possible. It's free food. Doesn't take up your inventory. So you should always absolutely do it. Okay, so we've got one palm frond. I'm going to need a lot more. It doesn't look like there's a lot of palm fronds on this island at all. Which definitely sucks. Look how many trees there are. Why are there no small ones? I guess maybe we should try and get the axe. Have I got the axe? Maybe I have. Oh no, we might just have enough now. Just have enough. Oh, I need one more. One more. Come on. Be one more palm front on this island, please. Yes, there it is. Just in time as well. As it gets a little bit darker. Oh, now we can carry so many more items, which is good. So we'll get a little bit more of this. Might get one more stick as well, because I realised you do need a stick to repair your boat, like, or make one. Or no, it was enough grass. Always make sure you've got enough grass, just in case the unimaginable happens. So, if we take a look at the boat, you always need four thick grass and two ropes. Top tip, always, always, always make sure you've got that on you. I've got some on the ship. I've got some on the ship. Yeah, that would do. Um, there are a few sticks on this island as well. I guess we could pick them up, but it's probably not that worth it. That's just a rock. I thought it might have been a truffle. No, we're going. We're going. I'm done. I am told you. We're going to We're gonna do it today. We're going to get all three signs so we're not messing around just gonna get my ship and i'm gonna go we've got enough food just about question is where do we go maybe that way maybe that is the way to the next one obviously we've got the blue there do not go into the reefs do not go gently into the night maybe it is i don't want to get all that way there it turns out it's not we'll go a little bit closer just a little bit close to this one We'll see if it is the one. Otherwise, that is a mission. If that is where we've got to go, that is long. If we've got to go all the way over that side. I don't think so. I think that's a small one. It's like proper in the water. So it's got to be this direction. Oh, there might be a little totem. It might be worth visiting this one just for the totem. For sure. It, right now, having wind would be good to make us go quicker. But the way the wind's going, it'd actually be against us. That's why I feel like the wind, surely the wind is trying to guide you, maybe in the right direction. Pick up some more palm fronds, because why not? Lots of pots to smash, so we'll get more of this currency, which I still don't know what we're doing with it. Oh, it looks like it's a stamina one. So these are stamina buffs. Yes, there we go. Oh, that's nice. Nice bit of extra stamp. Right, there's definitely nothing on that side. There's no there's no markers. That's the great big one. It does look like there's something in the distance there. I've got a feeling it's right across the water. I don't think it's to the edge. I think I feel like the game probably keeps them more centralised. Yeah, that little one is just like a bonus. I don't think that's the one. So let's go all the way over to that little faint dim outline. It's like right there. I really hope it is. If it's not, that is a long old trek back. No, it's not. It's like some bonus one. It's not the one. So I have been on one of them craggy ones before. Go and check out the video where I've done that one. So we know it's not that one. I'm not going to bother with that one. Maybe it was behind, like proper behind. It's like that lightning is like there. Do you think the lightning is actually saying, hey, come here? No, look, there we go. Yeah, maybe that's what the lightning does. 
Shows points of interest. I'm not sure. I'm not confirming that. Oh, but that, this is a mission. That is all the way at the edge there. Okay, well, this will be the third one. Then we've got to sail all the way back to Castle Grayskull. Oh my god, that was a long old journey. Thank God for YouTube edits, eh? You didn't have to suffer the pain of me sailing, sort of paddling along for like 10 minutes. Obviously, it will get a lot better and easier once we get some better rafts. But obviously, I'm just moaning a little bit. Just a little bit now, just a little bit. There we go. Huh. Oh, I'm so glad. Honestly. I thought I was just playing the game really badly. I probably was playing it really badly. But we've finally gone out to activate all three. And we'll get to the next chapter. Which is pretty exciting. Oh, there's lots of uh, palm fronts. Like, we're fully geared up now. We've fully got all the stuff we're going to need, I think. Might as well get to ten, since they're here. No! Ah. Yeah. Yeah, the jumping in this game needs work. It does. Hey, we got it. We got the third one. Yes. So this should open up the keys to Castle Grayskull now. The Nautilus key. Captain Planet. All three colours. Okay, well, no, nothing, nothing saying here. Go there now, child. I guess we can make a uh, f an anchor. No, I haven't actually got any meat or anything, so we have got to be a bit careful. And we're away. Okay, the wind's sideways, so that's okay. As long as we keep the sail like this, we'll pick up quite a bit of speed. And we should hit Castle Grayskull momentarily. Oh, there's a bit of coral here. Got to be a little bit more careful to not break the ship on the coral. Okay, here we go, here we go. Okay, I'm, guessing, I'm guessing it does. Just stay there. It's not going to drop down. I've got the anchor. Okay, we're here at last. I have the power. Castle Grayskull. Here we go. Have I got any food at all? I have not. I have not got one bit of food. I'm just going to have to walk a little bit carefully. Because I'm li literally running out of stam. I've got to pray there's food in the next area. Well, not in the next area. I think it just expands. It's not like it's going to teleport me to a brand new zone it just means more stuff's going to open up so i probably will have to go to a smaller little island pick up some stuff there you go number three's done what's at the top of the door oh she's knackered she's cream crackered i hope it gives you a buff i hope it replenishes all your food or we could be in trouble maybe i this will get to spend my points oh hello Hello. Here we go. Ready, guys? We did it. We did it at last. Fourth episode in. We finally. There we go. Fits in nicely. Whoa, so this is the first part of the story. It shows the story on these murals. And we'll be able to uh, unlock more, obviously, as we go through. We're following what's happened. So the people worshipped the sun, or some sort of creature. Oh, but he fell to earth, this creature, maybe. And he would maybe help the, the, the people of the sea. And then he would, he would travel. He came to the people, we helped him. He makes him go along the coast and the path. It looks like a pretty big old creature. That's part one of the story. Cool, cool, cool. The first crossing. Rejection. Oh, God. Why is it called rejection? That's not good. Okay, so, yeah, nice area. Let's go. Oh, okay. And we have got our food back up. Nice. That's going in my top tips for sure. Okay, right. We've just got to go through here. Now, I think this might be a bit challenging. I think the storm might end up 
kicking in a little bit here. Oh, no, yep. Yep. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What is that? Have I just got to swim right through it? Hopefully it's not going like, to pop up and just eat me. Okay, look for the coral. Are oh, the winds like... Is it pushing us? Yeah, it's pushing us. Good. Oh man, I like it. I like it a lot. Great looking game. Music's kicking in. See, oh man, you don't see something rock sometimes. So maybe there'll be more to do with that dude. Oh, hitting the big waves there. Man, these waves are pretty tough. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, yeah, yeah, we've got to be careful about the swell. Breaks you into the rocks. I like it. It's just like a little extra sailing challenge. So you want to make sure your ship is fully repaired. I don't know. Maybe it repairs it for you. I, would, I got a feeling it probably repairs it for you. But we'll have to test that out in another video. To see how much help it does give you. Because it's repaired my health and my hunger. So I think it probably will do that as well. But we've just got back through it. Here we go. See the edge. Ooh, yep. Yeah. Got to avoid, avoid the big swirls. Ah, oh, it's a challenge. It's a real challenge getting to the end here without like landing on these things. How's oh, it settling down? Like, thank God. Oof. So I reckon that's going to get harder. Maybe this is where we get to upgrade some points. Okay. Nice. Ooh. Right, we can get... We can get extra damage over time with 500. Maybe we can buy two. Or we can get the effects of poison are greatly reduced. We haven't really run into any poisonous creatures. Or maybe what we lose something when we eat bad mushrooms? I'm gonna go for the extra damage. Maybe we can buy both. It's not that expensive. There we go. And now we got there, of course, it's pretty involved. Just give me give me my my perk. Is that it? So you can only do it once for sure. It's just the one time. Bestow the blessings. There we go. As so you can choose them maybe for the next stage. So I guess you might have to think about it. It's like, is there going to be loads of jellyfish and stuff? Right, I was about to jump into that water. I'm just like, no, you've got to go back and get your ship. Pretty sure you've got to go and get your ship. Just realised my anchor is on the wrong end of the ship as well. And there we go. We're through. We've done it. We've done the first chapter passing stage. There we go. The great fam. Oh my god. Right, this is not a good one. So it's basically this teaching me how to survive. Like we've got a proper cook food and stuff. So that first one, really, you live off the land. And then the second stage, we're here. And that's it, guys. I'm going to do this second part. Now we've done it. Now we've seen the endings. This is going to be another video. So make sure you go and watch it for sure. And go and check out some guides if I've done them already in time. Hopefully I have. I will see you for more Windbound very soon. Bye-bye.